December 24th, as of today. So it's that time of year again, no, no, and uh, no. I'm gonna be doing an unboxing video. Wow, so original. Crazy. No one's ever done one of those before. Alright, I'm getting pretty eager, and I really want to open this thing, so I'm not doing another take. This is the Optics Mag 271 CQR gaming monitor. And I've done a lot of research. It uh, took me a while to narrow down what monitor would be best for me. And I'm looking for a multi-purpose kind of monitor, uh, as well as one that would be very good for gaming. So looking for that one millisecond response time and looking for those 144 hertz refresh rate. What I have today, is what I've narrowed my search down to. And that would be the MSI MAG 271 CQR. As I said before, <laughs> it's doing really good. Man, where do I start? <laughs> I said new when I purchased it. Well, this box look like, looks like it's in far from new condition. The last thing I would want is, is to receive a used product for the price of a new one, even though I did get it on sale. Looks like I'm gonna need a knife to cut this tape here. The old half scissor trick should work too. Maybe it's an Ohio thing. All right. I'm gonna be honest with you, I've never owned a monitor bigger than 24 inches. This is gonna be quite a change. I, I, you know what, I take that back. I do have a 27 inch monitor, but that's specifically for my PS4. So uh, that's not, you know, Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and lay this down right here. I'm gonna be very careful. Last thing I wanna do is break my new monitor. All right, so let's go ahead and slide this out of here. Obviously, we have the power cable. Can't do anything without that. We got ourselves, uh, I think this is a display port. Yep, and we got ourselves the HDMI as well. Very convenient to come with those. Um, got a few screws here. I would assume they're for the base or for the back of the computer. And then uh, we got a manual here. Don't think I'm going to be needing this. Uh, hopefully, not anytime soon. All right. Then we have another cable here. Um, all right, very nice, very nice. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be honest, I'm not sure what this cable is for. I should probably know this by now. But, y'all gonna roast me in the comments. Not sure, I'm not sure what that is. But, I'll be able to figure out where it goes. And that's what's important. All right, ooh. And then we got ourselves a back of the stand here, that's a hefty piece. Uh -huh. This is the monitor, very nice. All right, re review over. That's the stand right there. There, very cool. This slides right in. It looks like, oh wow, okay. They have, they have a, a toolless assembly here, that's very cool. I'm not, you know, I don't really mind having to go grab the screwdriver, but um, it, it is convenient. So look at that, now we have our stand set up just like that. Woo! Oh my god, I can feel that curve, that's crazy. I've never had a curved monitor in my life. This is gonna be quite an experience. I've never had a monitor that I use for my computer bigger than 27 inches. I've never had a curved monitor or TV of any kind. I've also never have had a monitor above 75 hertz. So this is gonna be quite an upgrade upon a lot of levels. Very exciting. I'm just gonna split this off and just looking at it already. Wow, wow, man. Hey, that's pretty good. All right, I, I want you guys to see this. Oh man, but I have to be very careful. I think I have a good grip on the back now. Oh wow. Look at that. Holy. Wow. Look at this. That is fantastic. Holy crap. Wow, okay. Let's uh... <laughs> man, that just looks amazing. I'm 
Wow, okay. Let's go ahead and set this up. Oh, this is, this is a wall mount. So my is getting a little scuffed, isn't it? Didn't really know what to do once I had it open. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and take off this covering the beautiful etched MSI logo in there. I love it. All right, and then we got the tape for this. Nice glossy finish on the edge here. Very pretty, very, very nice. All right, so then we can proceed to snap this plate into the back of the monitor here. Oh, you know what? There's actually one of those on the stand as well um, to continue the design. It has a little hooks that you want to hook underneath and then allow the rest of it to rest into place. And then we have two screws located right here that are going to be holding it in place firmly. I'll be right back with the screwdriver. You know, you know it's kind of funny. I knew I was going to need this, but then I put it away. We're gonna go ahead and screw this in here. Very descriptive, I know. We're gonna screw the stand into the back of the monitor. I wanna make sure it's tight. How tight is that shit? What? But I, uh, I wouldn't recommend, I wouldn't recommend forcing it more than you, more than you think you should. I also don't believe I'm using the right side screwdriver, so I ought to be careful. I believe it is securely in there now. Let's go ahead and have a look at it standing up. Oh my. Okay, be very careful with this. Trash. All right, now here's what we got. Oh, T trash. Man, this monitor is gorgeous, isn't it? It's already a hair on it. It's already a piece of hair on it. So, okay, I, I suppose I should continue describing it a little bit. This curve is amazing. I cannot wait to see how it looks playing games on it. Yeah, I still play Fortnite and I'm goaded on the sticks. So I'm gonna love this thing. I believe this tilts. Yes, it does. It tilts up and down very clean, very nice. It does not swivel. However, that is not very necessary because you can just move the whole monitor. It's the same idea. It also has a height adjustment. That's okay. I think this is the height I wanted at anyway, so we're just gonna leave it for now. But it can adjust in height if you would like it to.